Hi, Andrew Bell here, and we're delighted to be coming to you today from the event 2020. I've just stepped off the rostrum for this auctioneer. This is the highest profile marketing campaign for residential properties undertaken each year anywhere in Australia. As you can see, it's a very busy, robust room, and it's been nothing short of an amazing day. I mentioned in previous reports that 2020 started off on a strong note. It certainly has. The strongest sales activity has been happening either ends of the market. The most affordable end in the sub $600,000 range and the higher end in the $4 million plus range. Now there's two factors that have been driving the market. I've already touched on one in my previous reports and that is Australians have worked out that it's crazy for them to leave their money sitting in the bank as it earns no interest. And with the stock market hitting new record highs, there's a sense that the bubble could burst and so many people are tending to shy away from the stock market too. People have also identified that the real estate market went through its price correction through 2018 and a good deal of 19. And real estate prices are now very attractive. It's been an easy choice right across the country for people to re-enter the real estate market and there is the old saying, it's as safe as houses. There's also record low borrowing interest rates. So today here, we see the activity auctions. That's on the back of a very strong start where we recorded over 80 sales in the first two and a half weeks of the month. We're currently providing the best interest rates in the country to match all that buyer activity with 2.99% for owner occupiers and 3.64% for investor or landlord purchases. It's also this enormous desire by retiring baby boomers for some quality of life. They're downsizing and many are choosing the Gold Coast as their preferred location to live. However, there is the other side of this very important equation and that is supply. The latest figures from SQM Research show the number of homes listed for sale plummeted by 30.1% in Sydney over the year to December and in Melbourne by 16.4%. All capital cities also recorded large declines in property listings in December with the steepest drop again in Sydney at 28.7% followed by Canberra by 28.1%. There's not figures out at the moment just for the Gold Coast but this decline in the volume of listings of properties for sale is fairly typical right throughout the country. So we have this very simple equation. Buyer interest has risen substantially. Realestate.com.au reported that search data by buyers is up substantially. The closest recorded increase is Brisbane, which recorded a 63% increase in searches. So the buyer interest and demand is up substantially. And of course, according to SQM research, the supply has fallen sharply. That simple equation of supply and demand bodes very well for a strong year in real estate. Now, the big lesson to all buyers is to get in fast. No question, finance takes a lot more work to secure, but it's obtainable. Money is available. You just need a good broker to do the legwork for you. And the next step is to get out and do your house hunting. However, don't put it off. The longer you wait, the more you'll pay. We came to the auction room today with already 12 properties sold prior to auction. And we're witnessing sale after sale occurring here today. We will, of course, post enormous number of sales in the post-auction period as well. We're, of course, left with a mighty lot of buyers who've missed out on properties today. So we're desperately looking for more listings. So if you're a seller and you're thinking about selling, please give us a call as we have a very large pool of ready, willing and able buyers all set to go. I trust you had a great Australia Day, which wraps up our Christmas, New Year holiday season. And it's great to see this blessed country once again receiving large volumes of rain to help in the recovery from our fires. Proud of you, Australia. You excel in challenging conditions. Well, that's it for today. I have to get back up and complete the balance of the auctions for the event 2020. All the best for now.